We'll let you know when the sun will be back out again for that forecast. And we hope you're hungry this morning. Thanks again for being here with us. This weekend, you can be a part of the Bite of Seattle. It's a time to celebrate some of the best food and drinks our area has to offer. And there's one special part of the event that helps benefit Food Lifeline, our state's largest hunger relief organization. And this morning, we are joined here by Sierra Laub and Chaz Roland, the owners and operators of Conscious Eatery. Thanks so much, guys, for being here with us and joining us this morning. Thank yeah. you for having yeah. us. Of course. So we've got food here. That's where all of our eyes are on right now. What are we <laughs> making this morning? So we're making our spring salad that we serve okay. Monday through Friday in our restaurant. It's organic spring mix, goat cheese, local strawberries and blueberries, crispy fried yams, and some sunflower seeds. Ooh. Really healthy, but also gives you a little bit of sweetness. And that's what you guys focus on at your restaurant, healthy, conscious food like that that we can all enjoy. Exactly. Oh, yeah. Food sourced locally that you can be proud to eat, and then for every meal purchased through us, we donate to one in need. And for newbies like myself, never experienced the bite, what can you expect if you head out there this year? Ooh, if you head out there this year, you'll see over 200 different types of businesses, artisan businesses that are here from Washington, and it's it's amazing. The bite, the alley is incredible. For every um, meal that's purchased, basically, um, for every dollar that's uh, spent, you they donate four uh, meals to those in need. And so, is what's the strategy here? When you go to the bite, is it like pace yourself a little bit here, a little bit there? Because there's a lot of options that you're going to get to partake in. That's usually the hardest part, right? <laughs> there's so many options, so that's why the bal the alley is kind of perfect because you get six tasters from six local different restaurants. So you, not only can you take what you ate at the bite, but you can also continue that after the weekend. And tell us about the alley. We've been talking about that a little bit, but how does it benefit Food Lifeline here? Yeah, each dollar that's raised, they donate four entire meals to people in need. Wow. And yeah, that's... It's going to help fight hunger right here in our community, something that's so important, right? Absolutely. Definitely. All right, so let's talk about this food here. Get back to this a little bit. So how do we do this? So first, we take our champagne vinaigrette that we make in-house, and we toss that inside of our organic spring mix. Shout out to Charlie's Produce. They run an amazing produce program to make sure that they're in line with what we are doing here. We'll put this onto a plate. Next up, we'll throw some fresh goat cheese on top of it. Just a nice little sprinkle will get us nice. going. Oh yeah, so this is healthy. You can eat it any time, snack, lunch, dinner. Exactly, exactly. And we're in a perfect time of the year right now, so strawberries are at their peak freshness from the local area. So we grab those. We'll grab some blueberries as well. Throw that all around the salad. Look a little bit more over here. Yeah, that was missing a little bit, yeah. right? <laughs> perfect. Sunflower seeds. And then we take these crispy yams and just top them on top just to give it a little bit more texture, a little bit more color. And there you go. So when you go to the bite, you can expect to see meals like this. But what else can you expect there for people looking to taste some different types of cuisine? It's all the whole entire spectrum. Okay. So we have our buddy that runs for Rally Restaurant that's going to be right next to us in the alley. We And then all the way down to what you would consider fair food. So okay. no matter what your appetite, no matter what your dietary restrictions, you're going to find it there. And what are some of your favorite things about the bite? I'm interested to know. Um, realistically, the people. It yeah. seems like when you when you generate an event around food, nobody's upset. Yeah, so. <laughs> that's right. Good Every vibes. time, so good vibes, good yeah, people. Yeah, the so. music's amazing. Yeah, absolutely. Well, thank you guys so much for being here with us this morning. And of course, if you need more information about all of this, just head right to our website, Q13Fox. Com. Well, thanks again. We'll send things over to MJ 